Dean, uh, a trip to Kings Lynn awaits and a chance to go three unbeaten. Yeah, uh, look, I'll be saying one game at a time. Kings Lynn had a fantastic result at the weekend. They showed a lot of character, especially when they were 2 1 up in the 92nd minute and made that managed to equalise. And then Kings Lynn went up the other end and got a winner. So shows they've got a lot of character, a lot of spirit within their team, and there's no easy games within the division. So we are looking forward to the challenge. It's a different one to Saturday, it's a different one to when we played Weymouth as well. Um, very technical side. And um, they all know their jobs as well. They've managed to coach really well. So it's going to be difficult to go anywhere in this division and get a result on a Tuesday night. Well, what are you expecting from them? I mean, we'll go above them uh, with, with victory tonight. I don't look at that. Uh, I look at points per game. And that's what I look at. That'll tell you how you're getting on when you're winning your own football club. Um, I don't look at their points, our points. Um, all I look at is the opposition and how we can beat them and look at ourselves and that's so important uh, that we focus on what we can handle and what we can do. Uh, we can only affect what we can affect. I mean, having put in a, a solid performance at, um, against Halifax Town on, on Saturday, what are you expecting to see from the players tonight? We need to improve in possession. We need to be better. We need to manage the game better in possession. A little bit more creativity. I'd like us, you know, to, I'm, I'm just being not critical. I'm just looking back at the game basically and saying, right, we can do better in this department and that's a department we need to do better in. Um, and we need to sustain attacks better so we're not playing a basketball match. I know they're quite attack minded, uh, Halifax, but we are too. And I want us to be attack minded. I want us to defend from the front and play on the front foot. And I think if we can improve within our possession and move the ball a little bit quicker within two, one and two touch, I think we'll be a better team. How, how can we make that happen and be more clinical in front of goal? Because we, we did create a few chances uh, against Halifax. Yeah, they had four chances within the game. We two actual clear chances. Uh, one to Mitchy Brundon and one to uh, Sam Beard. Halifax had two up until the 90th minute and then they had a the chance of McCorner where Sarge made two good saves. Um, and it was a tight game, it was a tense game. Um, it was quite a tactical game as well. Uh, but look, we're delighted with the point, we respect that and we've moved on to the next game. So from our point of view, we want to keep improving on performances and results is what matter. And is it a quick turnaround for, from Saturday? How, how are the lads faring? Yeah, we come in Sunday, uh, we debrief Saturday's game, drew a line underneath that and then started looking towards from yesterday which was Monday, we started looking towards today's game. So uh, the lads have made the sacrifices that uh, you need to win football uh, matches at this level. And uh, hopefully we can perform tonight and uh, get the right result. A, a, a clean sheet means we've got something to build on going into tonight? Yeah, great to get a first clean sheet of the season. I'm a big believer clean sheets bring you success. You know, if you look at all the teams that get promoted, look at Sutton last year, won the division, there's no doubt they were one of the best defensive records. That's so important. Um, and that's sort of our base, that's what we want to build ourselves on. So Sam Sargent was in two Team of the Weeks for, from his performance against Halifax. Uh, more, more to come from him, hopefully. Hopefully he doesn't have anything to do tonight. And uh, If we could defend better from the front, we don't give him anything to do. But he has to organise, he's got a back, he's got to keep, his line, uh, keep the defence out of his box. And if he's called him on to make saves, that's his job, that's what he has to do. And, and under the lights, uh, always make for special occasions, don't they? Yeah, I love Tuesday night games. You know, it's windy today, it's wet, it's been raining up there all day. So it's a proper National League game, so we're really looking forward to it. Thank you, Dean.